The Independent National Electoral Commission is walking a tightrope and the successful conduct of the 2019 elections is at stake. The budget for the coming general election, which is less than 200 days away, is hanging. Mid-July, President Muhammad Buhari wrote a letter to the two chambers of the parliament requesting a speedy approval of the supplementary budget of 242.45 billion naira expenses for the polls. To ensure that adequate arrangements are made for free and fair elections, it has become necessary to appropriate funds to enable the relevant agencies to commence preparations. INEC and the security agencies have accordingly, accordingly recently submitted their request. These have been subjected to usual budget evaluation. The aggregate cost of the election is estimated at 242,445,322,000 billion, 322, But days after the letter was read, the issues of party politics and alleged victimization of the Senate leadership warranted an abrupt shutdown of the two legislative chambers. The Senate president is questioning the timing of the request. He says the executive had the whole time to present the budget, but chose to do it at the last minute. We want a free and credible election. But what we don't like is where the wrong message is being passed down. Okay, after you submitted the 2018 budget, you had December, you had January, you had February, you had March, you had April, you had May, you had June. Another area of contention is the president asking the National Assembly to make a violent of the total sum on the 578.31 billion naira the lawmakers inserted into the 2018 budget as constituency projects. Beyond legislative matters, the lawmakers are divided across party lines. The defections have further polarized the assembly, and forming a quorum is now more difficult as suspicions grow amongst the lawmakers. As political activities reach a high pitch, time is running out, and the election budget is stuck in the gridlock of politics. The INEC chairman, who must avoid a shoddy preparation ahead of the elections by taking care of the commission's cumbersome procurement process and time, said he got assurance from the leadership of the National Assembly that the budget will be passed as early as next week.